Hey what's up everyone this is Nash. In this video we are going to have a look at Halogen OS for my Redmi Note 4. Currently I am on EOS P extended room and we are going to flash Halogen OS and I'm going to give you my first impression on that. Flashing this room is just like flashing any other room. All you need is room and gaps file and you need TWRP custom recovery. And make sure to take full Android backup before you install this room or any other custom room. If you don't know how to take full Android backup, you can watch the full video in the i button. Now let me quickly fast forward this for you. So Rome is installed properly, let me quickly set it up. Room looks neat and clean, there is not much of the junk inside this room and also it has custom CAF based browser. First of all we are going to check how much free RAM you get from very first boot. As you can see you get 2.5 GB of free RAM. And as you can see it's based on latest Android 7.1.2. Can't find any crazy easter eggs in this room like AICP. OTA is supported so you can easily update this room. Rest everything looks like pure EOSP so if you're looking for pure Android experience you should try this room. Now let's quickly check the customization this room provides. As you can see there are few customizations and I will talk about them in my full review. Normally you get very few features and customizations in CAF based rooms. So this room is not for features. If you are looking for that you should try Resurrection Remix or some other room. Apart from Redmi Note 4 this room is available for OnePlus, Nexus, some Samsung and LG phones. And for your convenience the developer options are pre-enabled. This room is CAF based room which normally gives you nice battery life. Difference between AOSP and CAF is that CAF based rooms are normally made for Qualum hardware and they have heavily customized kernel while AOSP uses standard Linux kernel. You can dirty flash this room on top of some AOSP rooms but I won't recommend that clean flash is always safe. And as you can see Google Assistant is working perfectly in this room. Tell me a joke. The camera in this room looks different. It looks like this is modified custom camera. It can shoot in 4K UHD and also slow motion at 120 FPS. So that was my first impression on Halogen OS on my Redmi Note 4. If you want me to make full review of this room, don't forget to like this video. And if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe because I make this kind of videos almost every day. This is Nash and I will see you next time. Ooh.